hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel by the time you're watching this it's thursday i'm going to be doing a video every day for this week pardon my nails they're looking hella chipped i'm going to do something about that by tomorrow so anyway i got this braids done these cornrows the mama charged me 500 kenyan shillings if you want her contact just slide in my dm my instagram handle is at nyole chronicles slide in my dm and i'm going to give you the contact so she did a nice job i actually loved it don't get me wrong this video i'm not going to complain about the work she did it's rather i'm just saying my sentiments about my hair like she did do a good job she did do a good job i did love it the, the first two three four days they were lovely until it started raining my hair started absorbing the moisture and then i had this look at this i had this so as you all can see my hair peeps through the braids it's just peeping shamelessly shamelessly there like granted i did the straightening if you're in kenya then you know what straightening is this is like blow dry that you just use to comb through and like detangle your hair so i did the straightening uh because i didn't want to give her hard time because i knew it would have been trouble if i do the african threading my hair wouldn't have been that straight to allow her to control my hair so i just did the straightening it costed i think 100 kenyan shillings i just went to a local salon and did that as she was braiding my hair by the time she was at line two i'm going to insert a picture of that i think i took a picture my hair had already started shrinking it was already absorbing the moisture from the atmosphere so it was shrinking so i had to go get it straightened again and then come back so that she can finish controlling my hair and she did a nice job i got so many compliments and i loved it but i feel like it's also high time i get a wig because if I don't get a wig, I know I'm going to find myself constantly braiding my hair and I don't want to do that. Because I feel like my hair is in that awkward stage. It's not short, but it's not either long. Like it's just in an awkward height where you can't really do much about it. And I don't want to, to yeah, I just, I just want change. So I want a wig. Most of you guys co commented and told me I should go to Makeup Cloud KE and also dubois road a couple of you said you get your wigs from dubois road so next time i'm in nairobi i'll definitely check it out but i just feel like this struggle i don't know if guys for with other hair types you go through this like does your hair do this does it peep out within a few days i know if your hair is relaxed you don't know these struggles and that is one of the reasons by the i love 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 afro kinky afro kinky even if your hair does do this You'd never at any point notice that this is hair and this is Afro kinky. You'd never notice it. So you understand why I love Afro kinky now? I think I should just stick to that or maybe next time I get cornrows, I'll get cornrows with Afro kinky. But anyway, if you're along thicker road, Nairobi, and you'd like her contact, just slide in my DM, I'll give you her contact. I don't know if I've already showed you this, but I used this braid. These are just the normal darling Abuja braids. The packet goes for 60 bob. She used four packets, so I have one left. So I'm going to stay with this hair like this. Yeah, until tomorrow, because tomorrow I have errands to run. So I just need to go do the errands and then I come back. I'm also so sick and tired of people complaining of how my hair is too thick. So I don't know what they want me to do by them complaining my hair is too thick. And then they're always going like, He nyuelo ukieka chemical si itashika vizuri. Like yo, did I tell you I want to put chem? Like did I? Did I tell you I want to relax my hair? Like I don't know. Some people are just so concerned about things that do not concern them. I just hate getting those remarks. So people telling me like, he nyele itaka mzuri ukieka dread. Like, if you're not Kenyan, that means like your hair will look good if you put dreadlocks. 
like i have nothing against relaxed hair i have nothing against dreadlocks but i just feel like that is not my preference my preference is, is my natural hair the way it is like why does somebody see the need to want to divert you toward their direction does that even make sense like why does somebody see the need that i should relax my hair that i should lock my hair that i should blow dry my hair more often i think what they're trying to do is just get me to have heat damage which i don't want because i already have heat damage here on the front as i showed you on my instagram stories so anyway you know that's just the struggle but then it's all good it's all good now you understand why i don't go to salons i think you all understand now i don't go to salons why i just prefer doing my own hair I would love 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 to hear some of the struggles you go through as a natural hair as a relaxed just any hair struggle you go through please leave a comment telling me any struggle you go through i'd love love to hear from you so i feel like as an alternative next time i do get these controls i'm going to get the bandica if you're not kenyan and you don't know what bandica is this is whereby they control your natural hair and then they control the synthetic hair and then they come and sew it on top so that it looks like it's your hair. They usually last way longer compared to this because your hair is not showing out. So yeah, somebody recommended that. I think next time I'm going to do that, get those, see if they last longer. Definitely they will because my hair won't be showing. We are done, we are done. So this is how my hair looks. I'm just going to stay with it like this and then I'm going to come back tomorrow. So I'm going to stay with it like this. I just put in my apparel and accessory bonnet and then I sleep and then I'll just see you tomorrow. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video, my rant. If you feel my complaints and if you can relate with them, leave a comment telling me. I'll see you again tomorrow, okay? I'll see you again tomorrow, okay? You know I love you. I love all 1800 of you. By the way, I got to 1800 subscribers today. But let's get to 5,000 subscribers so that we have a giveaway. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. Bye. Love ya.